the KC-46 A Pegasus, and the A-330 multi-role tanker transport, known as the KC-30 in military service, stand as leading contenders in the field of aerial refueling and multi-role tanker operations. Developed by Boeing and Airbus, respectively, these aircraft showcase advanced technologies tailored to meet the rigorous demands of today's air forces worldwide. In this video, we will delve into their key features, performance metrics, and operational advantages, offering a comprehensive analysis of how these aircraft contribute to enhancing aerial refueling capabilities and mission flexibility in contemporary military operations. The Boeing KC-46 Pegasus, an advanced military aircraft manufactured by Boeing, is designed for aerial refueling and strategic transport missions. Built upon the reliable Boeing 767 platform, it has been chosen by the USAF for the acquisition of 179 tankers by 2027. This wide-body aircraft features a sleek low-wing design, with internal flight controls ensuring agility and maneuverability across its operational range to counter potential threats. In contrast, the Airbus A330 multi-role tanker transport is a European aircraft. It is a military derivative of the A330-200 airliner. It serves dual roles as an air-to-air -air refueling platform and a military transport aircraft. While seating capacity-wise, the KC-46 can accommodate up to 114 passengers, whereas the Airbus A330 MRTT is designed to carry up to 300 passengers, making it suitable for both military and civilian transport roles. The Boeing KC-46 Pegasus, with a length of 165 feet, 50.5 meters, is notably shorter than the Airbus A330 MRTT, which spans 193 feet, 58.8 meters. In terms of wingspan, the KC-46 Pegasus measures 157 feet, 48.1 meters, whereas the A330 MRTT boasts a wider wingspan of 198 feet, 60.3 meters. The KC-46 has a maximum takeoff weight of 415,000 pounds, 188,240 kilograms, whereas the Airbus A330 MRTT can handle a higher maximum takeoff weight of 514,000 pounds, 233,000 kilograms, indicating its greater capacity for fuel and payload. The KC-46 can carry a fuel up to 212,299 pounds, 96,297 kilograms, whereas the Airbus A330 MRTT has capacity of 245,000 pounds, 111,000 kilograms, highlighting its role as a strategic tanker with extensive refueling capabilities. The KC-46 has a maximum speed of 570 miles per hour, 914 kilometers per hour while the Airbus A330 MRTT can fly faster at 547 miles per hour, 880 kilometers per hour, giving it a slight edge in speed despite its larger size. The KC-46 has a range of 6,385 nautical miles, 11,830 kilometers. Whereas the Airbus A330 MRTT 
offers a longer range of 7,500 nautical miles, 13,900 kilometers, making it suitable for extended missions without refueling. The KC-46, powered by two Pratt and Whitney PW-4062 turbofan engines, each generating 62,000 pounds, 280 kilonewtons of thrust. In contrast, the Airbus A330 MRTT is equipped with two Rolls-Royce Trent 772B and other engines, each generating 72,000 pounds, 320 kilonewtons of thrust. Features a main deck cargo door capable of accommodating up to 29.5 tons of cargo across 18 pallet positions. In contrast, the Airbus A330 MRTT operates similarly to a standard A330, offering a second deck capable of carrying 37 tons of cargo in eight pallet positions. However, the A330 MRTT faces volume constraints on its second deck and lacks a main deck cargo door like the Boeing KC-46A, requiring all main deck cargo to be loaded through passenger doors. The KC-46 Pegasus has been engineered for swift mission adaptation, seamlessly transitioning between roles to transport passengers, cargo, and support medevac operations. Recently, the 22nd Air Refueling Wings, KC-46A Pegasus, achieved a significant milestone with Project Magellan, the world's first non-stop westbound circumnavigation endurance flight. From June 29th to July 1st, this operation marks the latest maximum endurance operation for the KC-46A Pegasus, showcasing its capabilities as Air Mobility Command's newest tanker aircraft. Last year, the Republic of Singapore Air Force, the Airbus A330 MRTT, has become the first tanker in the world to be authorized for autonomous, air-to-air -air refueling, A3R, boom operations in daylight. The primary goal of Automate will be to automate the reception aircraft's operations, which calls for a number of novel technologies that serve as the foundation of the up-next Automate demonstrator. Thanks for watching. Please share your thoughts about both aircraft in the comments section.